Greetings, greetings, brothers and sisters. Peace and blessings. Peace and blessings. Now, today we're going to find out why Christ, the anointed one of God, the one that was called by God, must be walking the earth. Now, we are in our vain imaginations about this character, Christ, this one that many people worship, but they're not understanding that they have created an image for this person that God chooses. Now, this video is going to explain why we should have never created an image. Now, I have many videos on Christ or who Christ really is or who the Son of Man is. I have many videos on it. You know, if you don't know by now, I do call myself Christ. I don't call myself Christ. I also have to work to back it up. But like I told y'all before, if not me, then he is walking the earth. And like I said, if I can get my people one step closer to understanding Christ is walking the earth, I can get them one step closer to the rapture. So we're going to first start off by understanding how God chooses the high priest. Because we must understand that Christ is a high priest. Now, how do you become a high priest? You only become a high priest if you have been called by God, not man. If, if man have made you a priest, if a bunch of men that say, I like the way he teach, then no, you're not, called, you're not a high priest of the people. You are not the most high. But if God called you, you have the most highest information because you have his information. So I'm going to read a little clarification in Hebrews. It says, every high priest is selected from among men. So every high priest is selected from men. Every high priest. Not one high priest, but every high priest. So God is a living God because he always chooses living men that's amongst men. And is appointed to represent them in matters related to God. So again, then he's appointed. So God appointed him to go talk to the brothers in relationship to him. That's why he's the high priest. Just as Moses did. But y'all notice they got jealous of Moses, Aaron, and Miriam. You know, which is why, again, God was going to stir up jealousy. He always did. So if you, um, I just want to clarify that up, y'all. Every high priest is selected from among men. Now, if you go, if you jump down to four, well, I can keep reading, y'all. Uh, to offer gifts and sacrifices. He is able to deal gently with those who are ignorant and are going astray since he himself is subject to weakness. That's why God came in the likeness of a man. To also let you know he was also like a man. So if the man can change, you can change. So that's why God chose a man. But verse 3 says, this is why he has to offer sacrifices for his own sins. Now we're talking about somebody dying on the cross for you. So again, every high priest goes through this phase or through this challenge. Dying on the cross, making certain sacrifices. So when they talk about somebody got to die on your cross with their sins, then they really do, y'all, but it's just not explained to us correctly. So he has to offer sacrifices for his own sins as well as for the sins of the people. Now, verse 4 is very important because no one takes this honor upon himself. He must be called by God just as Aaron was. So Christ also did not take it upon himself, the glory of of becoming a high priest. So this clearly says Christ is simply the glory of becoming high priest because that means you are appointed by God. So I want to read another thing to us in John. Like I said, y'all, if I didn't call myself the son of man, then I would not be speaking. Uh, I want to go where I say the father has given everything over to the son of man. If you go to John 6 and 27, it says, Do not work for food that spoils, 
but for a fool that endures eternal life. So now we're talking about that fool for thought, that fool that's going to change your mind, that bread from heaven. Which the son of man will give you. So the son of man, the one the father choose, which is going to be a son of a man, which is why you can't have no image of him. Because you don't know which one this son of man is going to be. You just know he's going to have the spirit in him and speak in truth. That's how you're going to worship God. So many people are working for food that spoils right now. Many people get up and go to work for the food that's going to spoil in your refrigerator. But for the food that endures eternal life, which the Son of Man will give you, on him, God the Father has placed his seal of approval. You know, because I have, I, I, you know, I, a lot of people saying right now, y'all, that it's many Christ. I'm anointed too. Well, God called one man, y'all. Now, God elected many. And like I said, y'all, wherever that one man that I sure want to see him because I know who I am, so... Please reveal them to me, y'all, because this is what's going to free us. This is what's going to set us free out of Egypt. You know, Moses did have other people with him, but it was one Moses. You know, and we need to understand this, which is why we got to accept the will of God. I read that earlier. This is the will of God. What is the will of God? I read this earlier, y'all. I think it's in 5 and... I did read that earlier, like 5 and 28. It talks about the will of God is... Uh, I hate when I be having some, y'all, and I can't find it. But this was the will of God for you to believe in everything the Son of Man says. You know, it's in the book of John, y'all. You know, I be reading this stuff and... You know, um... Uh, I can't never find it when I'm looking for something. So you ask me what the sign of Jesus said. Nah. But it said this was the will of God, y'all. But um, so and like y'all, I got. I just want to. I'm clarifying y'all that Jesus is walking the earth. You know, you can't be waiting on somebody. Whoever you're looking for is amongst you. This is what they're doing this video for. Clearly is amongst you. This is why just as Moses was raised up among us, then Christ was going to be raised up among us, y'all. And that's what I'm doing this video for, y'all. I made it crystal clear. I don't think I might not share it. I might, I might upload it, y'all. I don't know. But uh, I got to get back to doing my videos. And I see, I, I get kind of sidetracked. I be wanting to say so much, y'all. Something be coming to my mind. And I can't say it. Uh... I can't find the scripture. It be killing me because it, it all goes together, y'all. It all goes together. You know, this was the will of God. You know, and, it, and it's crazy how, you know, we can't see it. I don't know where I read it at, John. I want to cannot pause. No, I can't pause it. I'm out, John.